Hey folks, welcome back to Let's Play Portal 2. I am good for one more episode tonight, and I'm grateful to have you all along for the ride. Let's see how far we can get. It's funny, even though we're only like, um, what, chapter 3 of 6, I think? We're already like puzzle, like 15 or so, so I wonder if there's more to the game after these 22 puzzles. I am definitely excited. Oh, that's the way I came. Up to a great start. I have a surprise waiting for oh, you no. after this next test. Telling you would spoil the surprise. So I'll just give you a hint. It involves meeting two people you haven't seen in a long time. Oh no. I feel like she's gonna like kill my parents now. Um, so they're different colors. Case options, okay. I was worried that would mean like more mechanics and like um, <laughs> the brake pattern, that's just weird. Um, more mechanics and then you'd see these more often if there's different styles now. Um, blue's a nice color. Whoa, freaky. Oh, that's weird. But also if you notice in there is the cheetah one, which was the one from that giant mural where they're you know, the bigger one was like at the UN or whatever it was. Alright, anyway, that's enough turret shopping for one day and one lifetime, really. Oh, look, more turrets. Imagine that. 16. Oh, that's so not fair. He's gonna shoot me through the thing. I don't know that I wanna hit this button. What's he gonna do? Shoot a laser up there? Oh, cool, okay. Yay! As much as I hate these guys, it is fun destroying them. I guess that's kind of the point. But how do I destroy you? Or is it just like, I don't go backwards kind of thing? I feel like that's going to be important somehow, but... I don't know, everything in this game seems important. And usually it is. <laughs> I guess that just means there are turrets here. So there are more over there. Oh, I was hoping I could like shoot the fallen panel locations, but nope. Okay, so if I open that wall, maybe I can get through. So let's see what I have to work with here. This thing. And button. Okay, so this keeps the laser going and then using the portals and the redirection cube. I can shoot it where I need to shoot it. I wonder if the laser can go through, like, either glass or, let's see, what color is that? Orange, that's not a wall. Okay. It can go through the glass, good to know. If only I had way to do that, okay. What if I use this thing? Alright, so I can laserify these guys. Oh, I see. And then by hitting this button, I can go through. Oh, is that really it? Seems pretty straightforward. Like they didn't just go like, like okay, so this button here goes to that laser there. They could just like ran up the wall and over, but nope, let's go all the way through here. Just to make it exciting. Oh, it's a birthday song. No, it's not. For he's a really like good fellow. Public domain one. Well, I think the birthday song is now public domain or ambiguously public domain, something like that. I remember reading about it a while ago. Or like the melody is, but not the lyrics, or vice versa. It says this next test was designed by one of Aperture's Nobel Prize winners. 
Oh. It doesn't say what the prize was for. Well, I know it wasn't for being immune to neurotoxin. Ouch. Yeah, they don't give Nobel Prizes in that, funnily enough. <laughs> the Nobel Prize for being immune, not, not like studying neurotoxin immunology, but like being immune to it. Um, like people who like work with snakes all the time and develop immunities to snake bites. You get the Nobel Prize of like snake venom immunity. But anyway, um, I thought there was a prize at the end of this, or am I not at the end of the level? Hmm. I feel cheated, but then again, I never did get my cake. Level 17. Yay, light bridges. Okay. There's a cube. Alright, well, at first glance, this looks pretty easy. Just go up there and move the cube, right? And then bring the cube down, hit the button, go home. Gotta be more to it than that. But let's uh, go with the obvious. I was like, oh, there's somebody there, but it, it's me. I see, and that raises the thing. Gotcha, okay. So, whereas this one opens the door, so I need to leave that here. But the key is going to be I need to also stop this laser somehow. Because otherwise I can't get to the thing to go up there. Um, okay, let's just play around here, shall we? Light bridge. Oh, can I light bridge up here? Oh, oh, look. Oh, I didn't know I could do that. That's so cool. Yeah, he's watching me now. Where can I throw this thing? Mm, there's no pits of doom, unfortunately. So you can go sit in the corner for a while. That's awesome. I didn't know you could do that. <laughs> wonder if you could have done that in some other rooms. I just never tried. Um, okay, so anyway, uh, back to the original plan. Actually, can I go across here as well? I could, but there's not really anything there. There is something here. Ooh, is this a hidden area? I hope this is a hidden area, not the way forward. But it's probably the way forward. Still, either way, let's explore. It doesn't seem like part of the puzzle, it seems unintentional. Oh no. That's why they put this wall here, I'm sure. Oh, I bet. I don't know if it's a solid piece, yes. Hmm. I don't know, it kind of seems like I wanted to like, see if you could solve the puzzle a different way first before I did this, but okay. I was like knowing if I'm like going like a you know, secret way or if I'm just you know, doing the way the game wants me to do it to go forward. Because usually I do the dead ends first for obvious reasons. Otherwise you have to backtrack or you never get a chance to do them. Water, oh fresh water. Let's take a take a swig of water here while I'm thinking about it. Mmm, yummy cold ice water. Yep. Been a while since we found one of these areas. This thing like seeing, only not with my eyes. Oh, okay, guess what? The song that I was also thinking sounded really familiar. Uh, that's because it's by one of my favorite bands, The National, who apparently did it just for this game. And I don't know the song super well or anything, but it must have come on like Spotify or something a couple times and, you know, it was rattling in the back of my head, so. Oh, cool. Tenacity is the top of the curve being shot by a turret. That summons the bell, help, the something, or it is Nell that summons to heaven or to hell. Skulls, some turrets, very creepy. Looks like a woman in an orange jumpsuit. Is that supposed to be me or maybe a previous subject? The bell. I can't quite make that out. Maybe you guys can. There's an equation here, phases of the moon. I wonder if this like all means something. I hope so. Seems like it would. Like, they put so much thought into this game, it's gotta mean something. 
Alright, I kinda don't want that now. There we go. Also, more hard drives. Too bad I couldn't escape with the hard drive. Not sure what these yellow cases are. Maybe where the beans come from. Alright, anyway, this is very cool, but. And like, is that like derivatives, like shading under the curve? I remember a little bit of that from calculus class. Alright, just don't think there's anything else here, though. Alright. Back into the puzzle, then. So that was cool, but not the way forward. Which, of course, begs the question, what is the way forward? Um... So I need to be able to block this thing, but with what? The only answer is the cube. But, so what does the cube do again? The cube closes the door. So I need to take the cube off it to get over there. And I need to be able to put the cube back on from over here, which is seemingly impossible. Okay, this one's a little bit puzzling. Is there are there more areas up above? Doesn't look like it. I thought that was it too. I was like, oh, this is the thing, but it's not. Just a secret area. Is there another secret area over there? I don't think so. It's to be lower. I'm just gonna walk around up here and see what I can see. I don't think that's a gap, like, come on, I'm all disoriented now. Oh, because I'm inside the portal, that's why. Oh, can I get in here? Not really, I can kind of go along the ledge, that's still pretty cool. Wonder what those did. Alright, well, okay. I can almost hop through there, but I don't really see anything up there to go to, so I don't think that's it. Alright, I gotta start thinking like outside the box here. It's gonna be something. Ooh, like what I just did there. Could I but there's no there's nothing higher than that. Like I can't make a portal thing above there and drop it through. And I can't interrupt it midway, clearly, to drop the thing. Hmm. Think, think, think. Alright, let's go back to what I need to do. So, I need to get up there. All this does is open the door, but it also could block the laser. No redirection, so it's either laser on or laser off, and the only way to put something in front of it... I mean, I could drop a, a cube from above for a second, so what does this do again? It moves the thing up? But that would be a very quick... like, I could... If I do this just right... I mean, it's only going to be for, like, literally a second, though. It didn't even, like, trigger. Um... Hmm. I can block the laser again, and then we're back where we started. So, I really haven't gotten anywhere, is what I'm telling myself now. Uh, and this thing here, I mean, I could go through that, but it doesn't really... doesn't really help me. Ooh, uh... I got it, okay. So I should have just done that with a cube. Yeah, sometimes there's a couple of ways to solve these puzzles. One's by just thinking. Sometimes it's better just to do, and then you'll kind of stumble onto it. 
All right, so now, gotcha, okay. Again, how do they think of this stuff? That's very impressive. So if I stand there, and then if I get rid of my orange portal, this falls down, and it falls on the button, so it all opens. Oh, wrong one. No. Oh, oh, I had, I had it. I had, I just didn't do it. All right, you don't go here. Orange is here, so I need to put the blue here. I need to put you on the blue one. Okay, there we go. And then if I interrupt either portal, it'll fall on the thing. Okay, so let's just shoot an orange one here, and then down you go. Open the door. I think I forgot about your surprise. I didn't. In fact, we're headed to your surprise right now. Ooh. After all these years. I'm getting choked up just thinking about it. This is not going to end well. I am not getting my hopes up. But at least I have water. And ice, as you can tell. Well, apparently it's bad for your teeth, though, so you shouldn't crunch ice. My dentist has been sending out tips during the coronavirus. Chapter 4, the surprise. Alright, we're halfway through the game. Now things are really getting exciting. Oh, lots of those dudes. Do not like. Well, this isn't creepy or anything. Initiating surprise in three, two, one. I made it all up. Surprise. Oh, come on. If it makes you feel any better, they abandoned you at birth. So I very seriously doubt they even want to see you. Hmm. Well, somehow I'm both surprised and not surprised, although I do like the confetti. That's a nice touch. There's a whole tube here just for the confetti. That's that's pretty great. Yeah, I feared they wouldn't introduce humans to the game, at least not this soon. I'd love to say like, recordings or something, though. What is that? Are they trying to shoot me? Can I jump down here? I suppose I can. Cannot move the furniture. Oh well. Oh my. That was not great. Okay, so. If I can redirect this laser into this wall with a cube. I don't have a cube. Gah. Alright, so I have this thing. That didn't really do anything. This is weird. Okay, that'll protect me from the thing. But, okay, there's a cube over there. So I need to, let's just go through here and I'll look at my bearings. All right, I seem to be shielded adequately from that dude. Oh, it's like a DNA helix. That's kind of cool. Cool design. Reminds me of, um, I don't know why. This is like digging in my brain from my childhood. Like the first Pokemon movie, wasn't there like something that looked kind of like this? In like Mewtwo's castle? I don't know. Now I want to watch it again, but one day. Um, maybe when I have kids, I'll have a good excuse. Okay, so uh, there's two different things here. And the laser, I think, needs to get through there to open them, I suppose. Well, there's five. Five? Oh my god, this is okay. They're getting complicated now. I was saying they were easy earlier. They are not so easy now. Um, I can't just get him to kill himself, can I? Probably not. And do I? Can I use his laser for something? He is behind like a grate, so I probably can't hurt him. Although I'd like to. I think I can't hurt him. I think I have to kill him with the laser. Is the idea? But I can't read it. So it's like a catch twenty two. I can't redirect the laser without a cube, and I can't get a cube as far as I can tell until I redirect the laser. Um, well, I mean, I can move over here just via a portal if I want to. But I still don't have a cube. I can go over here. But 
Oh, not so safe now, are you? I see. So he's actually not behind a screen in the wall. He's sitting there. Uh, and here's a button. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Oh, oh, interesting. All right, well, I think I know what I need to do, though. How do I get over here? Just for the portal, right? Okay. Where am I? Oh my god. I'm on the ground. Okay. I was getting ready to fall. Really disoriented, clearly. Okay, so actually, let's make that orange just for peace of mind. Let's click and make. I can, like, move around the room by. Ah, I can't get me. I can move anywhere I want. That's cool. Um, probably not the intent, though. The intent seems to be that I go back over here with this light bridge, and then I can go to different places. Actually, that's not what I was thinking, but, um, ah, all right, that doesn't seem to work, because, again, I, so I need to, I need to get, I was thinking I was going to get a beam through here to block those two from hitting each other, but that wouldn't really matter anyway. I could get them to land on a thing. No, they'd hit the bottom, wouldn't they? I don't know, but I can't. Again, I'm in a bit of a catch-22, because I, if I leave the portal there, I can't go anywhere. Because I can't, I can't get up there. So I can't use that portal for anything, unfortunately. You know what I can do? That's too dangerous. I can run across that and try to knock that guy off, but I, I can't get a thing that's directly... Ow, 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 ow. I mean, I can block the laser this way. No, laser... Okay, so laser trumps light bridge. Good to know. Um, I wonder if that means... Was there a guy here before? There might be a guy here before. But it could also mean I needed to destroy him. All right, so I need to stop those cubes from hitting each other when I go over there. All right, you know what? I feel like going over there was the way to do this. Let's try that again, shall we? All right, so we have this guy here. No white things above him anywhere. We have two things here, which seems like it might be important for some reason. Like, why would you do two unless there was a reason to? Um... I could shoot a light bridge across. Oh. Oh, but can I? I guess that's. I was assuming I couldn't shoot this little white thing from over here, but it looks like maybe if I get it just right. Unless this thing has stopped me for that reason, but I think I can. And I can. Alright, there we go. See? Careful with assumptions. Hey, now I have not one cube, but two. That's handy dandy. Alright. The orange. Alright, let me just move my way across here. You probably don't need to do that, but it helps. Um, okay, so I have a thing. I can't fire the gun while I'm carrying this, so that's kind of tough. Might just make a run for it. Maybe I'll like a pit stop for myself. I can aim it just right. Yeah, I can also just do portals, you know, that'd be easier. That's, the, I think, the real way to do it as opposed to my other method, but... Admit it, isn't mine more fun? Okay, now we can get rid of this guy and make things a lot easier, thankfully. Unless he shoots me first. You know what? I didn't want that portal quite yet, did I? Alright, now if I put a blue one right about there... No? He's 
its way over there, okay. I guess his line's at the angle, which is why. So what's directly across from him then? A wall that's not a... Ah, okay. I figured because his laser like focus is there, I could just shoot him, but... Easier said than done. Okay, what if I move my orange board a little bit? Okay. So I think I can do this, just gotta aim it just right. Did I get him? I think I did. Yay! Alright, let's do a quick save just to, uh, you know, just in case. Although I think it probably quick saves behind the scenes anyway when you reach stopping points like that. Okay, so that was part A. Part B. Huh. Alright, I'm not really sure what the hint means, so... I need to get clearly... Oh, interesting. So it's almost as if I want to like aim a, a light through here. There's nowhere to portal it. And interestingly enough... So that was already used for this. Maybe that's what it's for. Could be used again, though. It's very possible. But it doesn't seem to bounce the light or affect the laser in any way, so I'm not really sure how. Except maybe to get across to that thing in the, in the end. And we do have two of those laser things, so I can bend the light quite a bit. But I need to use one of them to get it through the portal. You know what? Can I launch? Can I do more of these? I bet I can just do infinite ones of these, right? Like, what's stopping me from doing that? Let's find out, shall we? Oh, does it disintegrate the old ones when you make a new? Bet it does. Yep, that is exactly what happens. Alright, so I get two and only two. Alright, well. Worth a shot. I think the first game did have some like developer's commentary. I have to uh I tend to watch that now. Maybe I'll do that when I'm done here if I'm getting ready for bed. Alright, so two of these things and I need to put one of them here. I see no way at all around that to get it through one of these walls. Although, oh, I'm not too bad. I do that, but then there's no portal placed at the end of it, so it doesn't really help me that much. So why are there two things here? That's what I want to know. Because there's five things in total. I got you. Oh, this is going to be tough. Um, okay, so I need to get all five of them lit up and get myself across there. <laughs> Jeez, that's, um, okay, I can light bridge across here is what I can do, but then I can't use the portals. I wonder if I need to continuously beam it across. So do I need to get, okay, so how many of these are there? One, two, three, four. And the fifth one, the one at the bottom there, is this thing. Okay, got it. So I need to get the light coming from over here. So I need to put... Okay, I need to... Okay, I gotcha. Oh, I got it. Okay, it's actually not that bad. Where's the other one? It's funny, everything seems really, really tough until you know how to solve it. I work my way backwards I feel here. About that surprise. Tell you what, let's give your parents a call right now. The birth parents who are trying to reach do not love you. Please hang up. Oh, that's sad. But impressive. Maybe they worked at the phone company. <laughs> she went through a lot of trouble to make the. Alright, yay. Well, what time is it? As much as I hate to say it, as much as I'm definitely enjoying this and want to do more, uh, yeah, I really should start getting ready for bed. So I'm going to call it a night. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hopefully you are enjoying this series. I 
No, I am. We are probably about halfway through, maybe a little more of the game, and uh, still a good bit to go. And probably, judging by the first game and um, just my instincts, I feel like it might be the more exciting half. I certainly hope so. So stay tuned. Plenty more Let's Play Portal 2 to come.